It's the Game Game Show, filmed live in the GVTV studio. Today's episode, Egyptian Rat Screw. And now, your hosts. I had a boardwalk sub and I want some grapes. But they don't even look good. Yeah, but I mean, They're the thing is, glassy. it's looking at me. It's, it's like, it's... <clears throat> Hello and welcome to the Game Game Show. I'm your host, Aaron. And I'm Tony. The name of the game today is Egyptian Rat Screw. The rules of the game are as follows. The deck will be dealt out in front of each of our contestants. The contestants will then take turns flipping one of their cards over, one each time. Now, the point of the game, however, is to slap the cards when two conditions are met. The first condition is when two cards of the same type have been laid down. Doubles. Or, when you play one card, another card, and then that same card occurred. Also known as a sandwich. Very tasty. Mmm, like boardwalk subs. If you are to slap the pile of cards and there has not been a double or a sandwich, you will have to forfeit one of your cards from your pile to the center. (sighs) Penalties are the worst. They are harsh. Ah, and the winner of our Egyptian Rat Screw game will win a $10 gift certificate courtesy of boardwalk subs. The game is about to begin. We're here on a farm in Egypt. And because of the holiday tradition, our contestants are about to enter the studio to perform the ceremony of the wheat. My name is Zach Hample. I am a returning contestant on the Game Game Show. Uh, I competed in Blood, Guts, and Sugar World, and due to a fairly complicated (laughs) cheating debacle um, and a large lawsuit, I am back on the show in order to try to reclaim the prize as my own. It's the worst. Nope. Oh, that will cost him a car. Oh, man. Hey, um, my name is Sean Mutan, and I'm here to win. I've never been yeah. on a game game show before. There we go. I'm gonna jack it Jack it up. Jack it up. Mm. There we go. King and queen. And jack. My name is Kristen Thomas, and I was pretty much kidnapped to play this game, and I'm not very good at this game to begin with, but my strategy is do anything to win. Uh Cards. Okay, (laughs) I'm not not ready. (laughs) Yep. My strategy to win. Um, I've actually, I've never like lost at this game before, so. I don't really need a strategy. Consolation for that. I, I can feel better about that. That first one. Yeah. Plan on getting in their heads, doing a little mind games, uh, messing with them a little bit. I'm going to start seeing different cards. Uh, it's just, it's not going to end very pretty. The only way she can get back in is to slap back in. Let's see if she can pull it off. Uh Oh. It's close. It was. (laughs) I don't care what university you're from, that has got to.
Sorry, we got it back. Why did I put down two? Cheers. Oh. Nice. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> I think so. That was Yes, it was. What an intense game of Egyptian rat screw. Whew. Now let's cut away to Clue. Last time on Clue, we discovered that one of the contestants is not a monkey. And someone lost their jacket. I say it was Mr. Green in the study with the rope. Doogie Schmaggle! Calm down. It's not that big a deal. Says you. I've only been to accuse somebody twice. You know, if you went back into the same room more than once, you could accuse people more often. I tried that, but White keeps showing me the kitchen card every single time. Well, guess I'll cross that place off my list. Hey man, no need to share private info like that. We need to keep this on the DL. Y you know, down low. We don't want the killer to know that we're on to her. <laughs> she says, Mrs. Scarlet in the hall with the wrench. Hey, I didn't do it. Don't tarnish my name like that. Worry not, my fair maiden, for I can disprove this vile accusation. What are you doing? What, what, what are you doing? She can't see out of the mask. A likely story. I think she's just trying to deflect blame from her personage by feigning blindness. Who are you? I don't think that needs translating. Hey, can we all just calm down? We need to think clearly to solve this case. What case? That's not body. That's a footless dummy. Seriously? How about a little tact, man? Don't speak ill of the dead. That's not the only dummy in the room. Do you have to do that? What? Well, apparently nobody can do anything without having to listen to your stupid color commentary. Excuse me? Yeah, you heard me. We're just trying to play a game here. I just lost the game. And you have to keep interrupting everybody. Dude, just because you're losing doesn't give you the right to call me out on this. No, no, no. You know what? No. Mm -mm. I don't have to deal with this. I'm done. Fine! <clears throat> go! If you're going to have such a wussy attitude about it. Will be continued on the next episode of the Game Game Show. Now, let's get back to the game. What an oppressive game of Clue. Let's return to Egyptian Rat Screw.
numbers. Or a queen. I feel the end. <laughs> ah. A jack with a stake in it. Loaded. Just like that, he goes from two cards to several. Third jackpot? Turkey? Is that it? But that was metal of kings, I didn't know that. A sandwich? Oh, okay. a very, very royal sandwich. A royale with cheese? <laughs> Lucky sevens, antibody, antibody. <laughs> Lucky kings. <laughs> Is it the same ring? It's all right, I didn't want her anyway. Awesome thing about it is those sandwiches from uh, Boardwalks. Oh. You. <laughs> Delicious. Take those. I'm no good, anyways. Wasn't risking it. Smart move not to. Well, after a horrible legal dispute and a failure on the last uh, game game show, Zach, you have returned to win the game. Congratulations, Zach. And you have won two $5 gift cards to Boardwalk Subs. Congratulations. Oh, it feels so good. And to our other two contestants, I am sorry to say you have lost the game. <laughs> Egyptian, <laughs> 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 